Creston College, your smart choice. mission is to develop leaders who have the courage to face the future with knowledge, vision, and harmony. In our quest for excellence in a diverse society, we pursue a broad curriculum. We emphasize a Christian ethos and the values of integrity, self-discipline, independent thinking, and respect. We opened our doors in 1996 with 75 learners in junior school. Current learner enrollment is 546 and growing. We strive always for a 100% pass rate. The full spectrum of the school, beginning with pre-primary, junior primary, senior primary, and high school, which is the college phase. We currently have 44 educators and seven teacher interns. Caro was founded in 1998 and Creston became part of the Caro fold at the beginning of 2019. This is the Caro footprint. Caro plans to have 197 schools by 2022. The four pillars of a Creston College education are these. Excellence in academics, a proud sporting tradition, a diverse and thriving cultural heritage, and a Christian ethos. IEB matriculants are well prepared for university. 98% of IEB matriculants that go to university graduate. The IEB produces consistent, reliable NSC results. The IEB plays an important role in maintaining standards. University marks, IEB matric students drop by an average of 10%. State matric students drop by 35 to 40%. IEB students at Stellenbosch are exempted in certain faculties from entrance exams. We are aware that our matric results are on a par with those in the UK. This is a list of the diverse international institutions which have accepted our matriculants. 
When looking at our 2019 metric results, one sees we achieved a 100% pass rate, 95% bachelor's degree, 5% diploma pass rate, 7 A aggregates, a collective 74 subject distinctions from the matric class were obtained. An average of two distinctions per learner was achieved. This is our academic vision. We strive for a 100% pass rate. We offer small classes, grade triple zero through to grade nine, and subject groups in grade 10 to 12. Learners to academic staff ratio, grade 10 to grade 12, is 13 to one. We change the way we learn by using technology at every opportunity. NSC requirements are as follows, 40% for English, 40% two other subjects, and 30% for three other subjects. NSC Diploma Pass, 40% English, 40% for three other subjects, excluding life orientation, and 30% in two other subjects. NSC Degree Studies, 40% English, 50% for other subjects, excluding life orientation, and 30% in two other subjects. This is a bouquet of examinable grade eight and nine subjects. Academic extension support in maths, Afrikaans, subject revision, Olympiads, advanced programs, professional therapist intervention with South Coast Institute for Learning Development, skilled. Academic subjects for grade 10 to 12. English home language. Isizulu or Afrikaans, first additional language. Mathematics or mathematical literacy. Life orientation. One subject from each of the following groupings. Life sciences, history, physical sciences, and consumer studies. Life Sciences, Geography, Business Studies, Design and Visual Arts, and Dramatic Arts, Accounting, EGD, Sport and Exercise Sciences. These are some of our past Science Expo achievers. Wahid Amenji represented Creston College, Southern KZN, and South Africa at the African Science Buskers Festival held in Lusaka, Zambia. He was placed first in innovation. He participated in the engineer energy category of OXEF, which took place in Turkey. Nelson Mandela said, sport has the power to change the world. It has the power to inspire. It has the power to unite people in a way that little else can. Sport can awaken hope where there was previously only despair. In the pre-primary phase, we focus on gross motor coordination by teaching ball and locomotor skills through a structured developmental play program. A variety of extramural activities enhances this area of development as well. In the junior primary phase, learners participate in the Learn to Swim program under the guidance of qualified Swim SA coaches and begin playing team sports such as soccer, hockey, and mini cricket and netball. In the senior primary phase, Creston introduces learners to competitive sport on a regular basis. Cricket, swimming, hockey, netball, rugby, athletics, cross country, soccer, and mountain biking are regular features in our program. In the college phase, the emphasis shifts to sport for a healthy lifestyle. Learners are encouraged to represent their school, UGU and KwaZulu-Natal teams in the different sports and leagues on the KZN coast, thus developing both their ability as sportsmen and women and their sense of camaraderie and esprit de corps. Sporting activities by term. Term one, cricket, netball, girls hockey, rugby and swimming. Term two, hockey, rugby, netball. 
Term 3, Athletics, Netball, Soccer, Cross Country, and Term 4, Cricket, Hockey, Swimming, Netball. At Creston College, inter-house events are highly competitive. The competition between the two houses, Eagle House and Falcon House, continues throughout the year and covers all aspects of Creston's extramural activities. A number of our sporting heroes have taken part in national sports tours and international sports tours. Our Sevens Rugby Tournament in Mauritius was a case in point, attended by the boys, and the girls were also represented in the Netball Tournament in Mauritius. These are a few of our external sporting achievers in 2019. These are our Ugu representatives in hockey. In swimming, KZN soccer, and hockey. We had several representatives in the 2019 Country Districts hockey team. Marik Pillay, one of our junior athletes, took part in the KZN athletics trials and was selected to participate in the South African Junior Commonwealth Games 2019. Some of our cultural activities include chess, choir, Eagle Crest Interact, drama, debating, marimbas, and Eisteddfod. We boast two KwaZulu-Natal Youth Choir achievers, who have also participated in international competition, Megan Strickland and Emily Wyatt Minter. And now drama high school cultural activities and achievers. We have boasted a number of high school productions of late, which have been highly spoken of. The Makanda National Arts Festival. We had drama learners traveling to the Makanda National Arts Festival in 2019, where they took part. The script was written by two of our learners and was performed by a number of them. The group is known as the Backyard Players. Madagafrica, <laughs> and Nomeo and Juliet. Cultural achievers include those who undertake Rotary Leadership Courses, the President's Award, and Toastmasters. And we proceed with cultural activities and achievers, the Kuro Art Superheroes, or CAS. This is an internal creative membership platform with a grading element where learners from grades 4 to 12 are encouraged to discover, develop, and display their inherent creative talents. Photographed are some of our learners who participated in the Kuro Art Superheroes in the various categories. Enormously important to the school are environmental activities to improve the school environment and environmental awareness to build young people's confidence and sense of citizenship through participation in environmental awareness, to increase involvement in the local community, to reduce litter and waste, and to reduce costs by saving water and energy. Trips and excursions are offered to provide a holistic educational experience. And in conclusion, it starts with why we believe in the future of South Africa and the African continent, in our product and the people who make it happen, in continuous improvement in a highly emotive sector. We believe that every child deserves a chance to succeed and be recognized as an individual, that every child matters to each one of us. We want to make a difference in this world. Thank you for attending our presentation.